Welcome back to Pokemon Silver. So in the last one, we evolved three of our Pokemon in our party, actually. First, let's just go here. First, we had our Sentret evolve into Furret. This is, our, well, Murr was a Sentret, now he's a Furret. Tamal evolved from Mareep to Flaffy. And then, finally, Jawsalm evolved from Totodile to Croconaw. Making this Croconawsum! Ha 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 ha, boy. Oh boy, these puns, man, I gotta say. And then we have just, you know, uh, Beedrill, Xander, Clockwork. Still looking for a name for the Beedrill, by the way. Anyways, we just stopped in here right after uh, we entered the city. Uh, I'd never talked to anyone. So let's do that right now. What's your deal? The Coliseum of Sarah's at any Pokemon Center is for Link Battles. Battle records are posted on the wall, so I can't afford to lose. Oh, interesting, okay. I don't, again, I don't know if I'm going to be doing that kind of stuff, though. This is multiplayer related. This is only a single player adventure, but let's see here. Well, I'll think about it. I wonder how many kinds of Pokemon there are in the world. Three years ago, Professor Oak said that there were 150 different kinds, but there's more than that, actually. There's actually 800, I, I'm thinking right now. Speaking of which, actually, today I went to GameStop and finally got myself those Mars Shadow Codes. Uh, figured I'd do that just before uh, they stopped giving them away, so now I can get myself one of those in my uh, Sun and Moon games. Let's see here, this girl says, A higher level Pokemon doesn't always win. After all, it may have a type disadvantage. I don't think there is a single Pokemon that is the toughest. Yeah, that is pretty true, actually. This is coming from a seven-year-old girl. Right there. That is something. Okay. This place is big, I gotta say. I was actually grinding earlier down here. Uh, and when I walked up here, I'm like, this is some place. What do you have to say? The radio tower in Goldenrod City is a landmark. Isn't that where Professor Oak does his radio show? They're running a promotional campaign right now. They'll modify your Poke gear so it can also serve as a radio. Ooh, I should go there if I can find it. This is a very big... It is big. Wow. Found the mall. The depth store, the department store, has a decent selection. But some items are only available as Game Corner prizes. Game Corner prizes? What? There's a Game Corner in this game. A game within a game. Mom's good at bargain hunting. She always buys stuff at lower prices. Let me see here. I'm raring to shop... What? I'm raring to shop again today. Uh, who even says raring? What? I'm confused. Hello. Welcome to Goldenrod Department Store. That's all you had to say? There's a register here. Oh, okay. I guess that's not where you buy anything. Uh... Ele elevator. Let's go up the elevator. Uh... Which floor? Uh, now on 1F. I can go to B1F. This is a basement floor. Huh. Let's go there. That is eerie sounding. Okay, well, we're down here. <laughs> what is that? What are you? Oh, a, a macho. Macho! Okay. What's up with you? I'll lose my passion for work if someone's watching. Come on, kid, scoot. Oh, okay, I didn't realize, sorry. Hey kid, you're holding us up. Oh, am I not allowed to be down here? Our policy is to work behind the scenes where no one can see us. Uh, isn't that something you have to force enforce on me? I mean... Oh, there's something over here. Hello? Okay. This place... Can I... Is there a hidden item, I wonder? This... This would be the kind of place that one of these corners might have something hidden, but I don't know. I didn't check everywhere yet. <sighs> this person's probably gonna get mad. Oh, aha, aha! The stuff on the ground's junk. Take it if you want it. Take it if I want... What stuff on the ground? Uh... Where? Not seeing anything. Not finding anything random around here. Uh, I don't think I'm supposed to be down here. Is this room supposed to change? I feel like these brown boxes sh could be moved somehow, but 
I don't think I have the power to move, to move anything. Alright. I guess the basement floor is for staff only, who knows. So why was I allowed to go down there? Huh. Eerie el they could have put elevator music, man. That is some eerie sound going up the elevator. Alright, now we're talking about shopping. I got my Abra at the game corner. That was my best partner. I misread that word very- oh boy. I thought that said bra. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, I can't. I can't hold that one in. <laughs> oh boy. It would have. Oh my goodness. Okay. Moving on. This is department. This department store makes me realize that Goldenrod is a big city. Oh, it definitely is. The selection here is unmatched anywhere else. Well, then I must do my shopping here, I guess. For now on, Poke Gear can store up to ten phone numbers. Oh, what? Oh, so no- okay. It's hard to decide which numbers to keep. So that's why the list doesn't continue. I, w I was actually looking at my f the list on my phone. I thought it was weird that you could, like, go scroll down but not far down enough. Like, it was weird. Oh, uh, how may I help you? Okay. Well, I'm... Let's see here. Ah, revives are- jeez. Expensive. Um, use it to escape from a lot of Pokemon. I never use those kinds of items. If you can just run, it's easier. But then again, if you can't run, there's nothing. Much, there's not much you can do. Um, we'll buy some of these. Five will, five will do. This game doesn't really give. <coughs> this game doesn't really give out a lot of money after defeating trainers. It seems. Uh, what do you sell? Oh, uh, potions. Wait a minute, this is a little different. There's Burn Heal and Ice Heal. Awakening. I kind of want an Awakening, but I don't know. Huh. Really, the only thing I really buy from these guys are healing items, like potions, like nothing that cures effects. Uh, and also Pokeballs, that's about it. This is, is this a staircase that goes up? It, it is a staircase that goes up, okay. I, I, I'm really impatient. I use X speed in battle to speed up my Pokemon. Oh, also that's something I don't buy much of battle items like those. Um, let's see. X speed. Raise it. There's an X special. Is that? It's weird that it's saying special. That's not. It's it's probably both special attack and defense if that's the case. Why is it cheap? That's a. It's much cheaper actually. Huh, you know, I want to I want to take one of them then. I don't know how helpful that would be. Ugh, okay. I forget what these do. Ups critical hit ratio. Prevents stat reduction. Raises accuracy. Okay. Alright. I never- I might actually use that X special like I kinda- I'm actually a little curious as to what it raises. It just it doesn't specify special attack or special defense, so I'm gonna guess it does both. Which is actually pretty good. Hey, when you use... Ah, oh my goodness. Hey, when you battle, do you use X special? It's awesome. It really jacks up the special stats. Both of them? I think it does. Huh. Alright. There's a staircase over here, too. This, this one goes up. Alright. What's up here? Welcome. How may I help you? You know what? I wonder. First... Can I just uh, see what I have here that I can per perhaps sell? You know, I've been stuck with one extra Apricorn for a while. Even every time I give Kurt an Apricorn, I get another Apricorn from the tree every day, and I keep getting this leftover Apricorn, so I'm just gonna sell it. Oh wow, 100. Definitely selling it. Yes. Okay, what do you sell? Oh! Ah, the, the, uh, what, do you, what, what would these be considered, uh, the medicine? No, not medicine, medicines, herbs, and whatnot. What is this? Um, I don't know. I wouldn't, I wouldn't really think of a, a name, I'm, I'm just gonna do that as it is. Let's just call it, uh, buff items. Hey, I love strong Pokemon. I feed them protein to crank up their attack. Oh, he says... Alright, okay. Whatever. Alright. 
Uh, we'll call them health foods, how about that? Iron adds to your Pokemon's defense. Yeah, I, I actually remember that. I actually kind of forgot that these existed in this game, to be honest. Some Pokemon... Wait, I didn't read that part. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, this guy's actually just listing all the Pokemon that, that you trade to evolve. You need a link cable. Machoke, Kadabra, Haunter, Graveler. I heard there are others too. Okay. Did I talk to you? I did. Okay. You can still go up. How many floors are there to this place? I thought there's only three floors. What is this? You can't rename a Pokemon you get in a trade. The name... Okay, so there is a name raider somewhere. The name is a reflection of the original trainer's feelings for it. Which is romantic. Except for when you get a, a Pokemon... I'm still annoyed that you can't rename Pokemon that aren't even named. It's annoying. Mystery gift. With just a little beep, you get a gift. That doesn't explain much to me, to be honest. I collect Pokemon. Do you have Drowsy? I caught a Drowsy, yes. I want to trade it for my Machop. That's a good trade. I didn't bring a Drowsy with me. Okay, what do you have? How many help you? Hello, what's this? TMs. An electric punch and may paralyze. What's the name of the move, though? A fiery punch may cause a burn. And I... Yeah, are these... Is this... Thunder punch, fire punch, ice punch? Attack may make... Flow finch? Flinch? Oh, another headbutt. Hey, another headbutt, TM. That's actually not bad. Oh, so you can get multiples. Do these change? Well, this one is cheaper. I don't know. But I want two Pokemon with headbutt. Is a, That's a good question. Headbutt is actually not bad. But then again, hold on a minute. But I want one of these. I don't have much money. Hmm. This is cheaper. But these have power to make super effective hits. I don't even have any fire moves. I don't even know if anyone... <laughs> Actually, I don't know... <sighs> thing is, I don't know who's going to be able to learn it once I buy it. If I buy it and it turns out no one else can learn it, that's bad. Headbutt, when I try to teach it to someone, uh, it looked like a lot of Pokemon were able to make use of this. And it isn't that bad, although it is a normal type move, so I don't know. Oh uh, boy. The, if, I had not, if I had more money, I wouldn't have a problem debating over which one of these I want. Because I can only take one of these TMs, or, or, or two TM2s. This is Headbutt, I'm pretty sure. God, I don't even know if these things stay in this door. Who knows? Um, I'm gonna hold off on buying one of those. They're expensive, but they could be good. But not as expensive as, the, as those buff items on the other floor. On Sundays, a lady comes to check out Pokemon. She even gives away TMs. For free? Oh, I'm down with playing on Sundays if that's the case. Well, uh, if I can. Alright. Um. Still going up. Okay, this looks like the top. There's some sort of server up here. What is this? Do you listen to, to Lucky Channel? If you want to win, trade Pokemon with as many people as possible to get different ID numbers. If you're tired, try the vending machine drinks. Your Pokemon will love them too. Oh, is this what this is? I thought these were just, like some sort of service things. It is a vending machine. Fresh water, soda pop, lemonade. A fresh water should do should heal as much as a potion or a super potion. A soda pop does a little more. But we're not really... Huh. I'm buying a fresh water. It seems pretty cheap for what it is. Okay. Alright, uh, that's it. Is there anything hidden? I, I don't know. Oh, whoa, whoa. It's Wade. Oh yeah, remember when Wade told us about that bug competition thing? 
I don't know what that was about, but he, he might say something here. Let's see. It's me, wait, isn't it nice out? Want to battle? It's not going to be a repeat of what the last time we met. I'll be around Route 31. See you later. Huh, Wade actually got a lot more interesting all of a sudden, wow. Okay, um... <sighs> Let me, uh, take the elevator back down. How many floors were there anyway? Wow, there's six! I thought- I didn't even notice that you could- Yeah, there's six! Well, seven if you include the basement floor. Jeez. I think my mic is a little too close to me, okay. Let's go to the first floor. There's probably... That, this is probably only like 20% of the town. Well, I haven't actually been up here at all. I see the sign here. Your playground. Golden Run City Game Coin. Oh ho ho ho. That sounds like fun. Let, let, I'm stepping in here. I gotta see what's in here. I couldn't win at the slots, and I blew it on card flipping. I got so furious I talked. <laughs> oh boy. I got so furious I tossed down my coin case in the underground. So you rage quit, basically. Wow. I taught Blizzard to my Pokemon. It was hard enough to get the coins for it, but it was worth it. I don't know. Blizzard has accuracy. Man. There's a lot of people in here. I always play this slot machine. It pays out more than the others, I think. Distracts. I just love this new slot machine. It's more of a challenge than the ones in Celadon. I've n I don't know what that place is. Are these machines that I can use right here? I'm just off to the side. No, I can't. Okay. Life is a gamble. I'm going to flip cards till I drop. You know, I can see why the developers had to take away this feature from later games. Card flip. I prefer it over the slots because it's easier to figure the odds. But the payout is much lower. <laughs> the strats. What, you, what about you? I haven't talked to you yet. I won't quit until I win. Oh my goodness. You know where I gamble? 100% orange juice. And that's probably, I don't know, the only place I have fun gambling in a way. <laughs> There's no money involved in it. <laughs> so yeah. Uh, what was this? Okay, coin case. That's, that seems important. We exchange your game coins for fabulous prizes. Oh, you don't have a coin case. So give me one. Do I go to talk to you? Welcome! We exchange your game coins for fabulous prizes. Oh, you don't have a coin case. Mm -hmm. Where do we get a coin case? Is there a basement floor to this place? I was wondering that that person that uh, said he threw his... Uh, you. What did you say again? I need to look at what you said. I couldn't win at the slots, and I blew it on card flipping. I got so furious, I tossed it out. Coin case in the underground. Coin case in the underground. Sounds like the name of a song, or a band, I don't know. Welcome to the game corner. Do you need game coins? So I need a coin... How do I really forget what the thing was? A coin case. Oh, you don't have a coin? Thank you for reminding me. Where do I get a coin case? Are these... Are, seriously? The service in here is so bad. Is there any... Where do I even go? Is there a basement? There's no basement. I don't see a place that goes down. Let's leave. Hello. Whew! This is one big town. I don't know where anything is. Ah, okay. Had to take a sip of a Snapples just then. My throat is a little dry. Oh, and residential areas. Hello. Oh, you collect Pokemon. My son, Bill, is an expert. He had to leave for the Pokemon Center in Ecotique City. How funny. The fact that Bill is a collector in this world, but when I think about it, how is Bill not a professor? I would totally tie Bill being a professor to Bill Nye the science guy. Not gonna lie. Wow, I'm rhyming. Are you a trainer? Yes, I am. I've got a useful phone number for you. Sure. Ah, I recorded Bill's number. So I call Bill Nye the science guy. Awesome. My big- oh, your big brother is Bill. So you must be Bill Nye's sis- daughter? Sister? I don't know. No, yeah, sister. 
Sister, yeah. Big brother. Okay. Oh, wait a minute. No, he's the one that made the PC. Right. Bill's PC. I want to call that guy, actually. Let me, uh... Let's do this. Hello. I'm gonna call you. Good day. This is Pokemon Storage System Administration Service. Who's calling? Alex, is it? Hang on a second. And it's on hold. Thanks for waiting. Alex, your box has room for only five more Pokemon. Maybe you should switch your box. Um... That doesn't seem important, actually, after all. That was just... That didn't really do much. That really didn't tell me a whole lot. Other than I need to switch my box? Hey, can I listen to your radio, by the way? Lucky Channel. Post anything, I think. Yeehaw! How y'all doing now? Whether you're up or way down low, don't you want to miss the lucky... You don't want to miss the lucky number show. This week's lucky number is... 22360. I'll repeat that. This week's lucky number is 22360. Match it and go to the radio tower. Oh. Okay. Hold on a second. Where do I go? Wait, no, that's not it. I have to. This is where I go. 223. I have a zero in the last digit of my trainer ID, so that is a match. Wonder where I go. Huh. I'm gonna find the radio tower. Hold up. I'll read but some of these other places. Well, I mean, I could find it eventually. I'm gonna check everywhere anyway. Underground and. Ah! Underground. Let's go in. There are some shops downstairs, but there are also. Oh my god, this place is big then. I'm scared to go down there. This trainer's down here. You know what? I'll go down here. We haven't even, uh... Hold on a second. Is there anything I can pick up in this room? Just kind of on the ground? I don't know. We haven't even battled yet. I've, I've been too busy checking out things. This is a trainer, isn't it? Let me, uh... Hang on a minute. Who needs... I'm gonna put Xander in the front. There. I'm guessing you're a trainer, yep. I got booted out of the game corner. I wasn't trying to cheat. Wait, I wasn't trying to cheat using my Pokemon. How would that work? I don't even know. Probably a psychic type of some sort. Super nerd Eric wants to battle. <laughs> he definitely looks nerdy. Super Nerd Eric sent out Grimer. Okay, we haven't seen this one. Oh, this is only a level 11 Grimer. Okay. This might not be bad. Except when I don't have anything super... I don't have anything super effective on poison types. Yet. Hmm. That's unfortunate. Okay. Clockwork really needs to... Get up there. I've been trying to... Get in some experience for Clockwork, but... I don't know, Clockwork's kind of falling behind here. This isn't the time to be falling behind, if you know what I mean. <laughs> oh my god. The worst, the funny thing is, it's about like, it's almost time for the whole fall behind time thing. It's like, it's close. I don't know when it is exactly. It's always like in the first week of November, though. Oh, come on. Poison gas. You have this. Oh, I, I came prepared. I got a, I had a poison cure berry on me. That's good. Man, this peck really does not hurt, though. Don't stop doing that. I'm probably gonna end up getting my, my clockwork poisoned here. Or not, I don't know. Oh. Oh. I don't know why you're trying to harden when you're this close to dying. It doesn't make sense. There we go. Okay, we have more. Another Grimer. Okay, Xander.
Yeah, we're gonna keep trying this. Clockwork can do it, it just takes a bunch of hits. Also, this poison gas is worrying me just a bit. You gotta use Harden, really? And this grinder doesn't really seem to know any actual attack moves, I don't think. All it is doing... Oh, there it is. There's a pound. Another pound. Ugh. Uh, dang it. Well, I have nine poison cure berries. Yeah, I have nine berries. I, I actually, this is not too much of a problem now that I think about it. Poison me all you want. I have all the berries to, to waste, really. Grumble. Okay, let me uh, cure the poison right now. Here you go. I could have used the antidote actually, because the antidote doesn't do uh, the stuff that a berry would do, such as well, having it to hold. Oh, and you turned at me. You're the one who looked at me. I that was not me looking at you. You looked at me. My Pokemon just got haircuts. I thought that said hilarious. <laughs> I'll show you how strong they are. Pokemaniac, I, Isaac, Isa. That's a strange way to spell that name. Is that how that name is spelled? I don't know. Kind of. Now you're making me think of Golden Sun now. Oh my goodness, Lickitung. Wow. Okay. Um, Lickitung. That Lickitung might actually be powerful. Let's see here. Mur, you can. I want to see you headbutt this one. Oh, this Lickitung like somehow knows cut. Well, so do I, but that's not what I'm doing. I'm using Headbutt. Hmm, that wasn't bad. Ah, cut can miss. I haven't actually seen cut miss yet. Out of all the times I used it, the first one to see miss comes from an opponent, which is unfortunate for the opponent, but fortunate for me. And Murr, I guess. Even though now we have headbutt, we never really need to use cut. That rhymed. Alright. What's this? Oh! That wasn't that- that did not take long. The coin case was right there, wow. In the key pocket. Okay, there's more to this place though. What is your deal? Welcome to the Pokemon Saloon. Salon. Oh, yeah. I am the younger and less expensive of the two. What? What is this? Haircut. Uh, I'll spiff, I'll spiff up your Pokemon just 300. So how about it? What is it gonna do? Is it, is this a happiness razor? You know what, then? Xander needs to be happy. I'll make it look cool. There we go, all done. Xander looks happy. Yep, okay, good. That is a, fr a friendship raising, uh, Huh, that's, that's good. There's more down here. Hmm. Do you consider type alignments in battle? If you know your type advantages, you'll do better in battle. Yep. I got everything memorized. Well, pretty much. Super Nerd Teru wants to battle. You have four Pokemon. Oh, Magnemite. Oh. We have not seen this one. Magnemite. Okay, um... Who am I gonna use here? Um, ac yeah, uh... I don't actually have much here. Now that I think about it. See, the thing is... Uh, I know that it's weak to ground, uh, fighting, fire, and... this. a another one out there, I don't know. No, actually, no, there's not. That's all it is weak to, that's it. I don't even have a single... Any... I don't even have any of those kinds of moves here, so I don't know what I'm gonna do. Jawsome can hit normally, but he's a water... She's a water type. 
Beedrill. No. No. Hey, you wanna use Metronome? Xander, get a ground move of some sort. That is not... That's not good. Thundershock. This might hurt. No, not really, actually. Now we're gonna... We're gonna knock it out with a metronome. No, 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 no. Don't do that. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. What the... What? What? What you... Okay. Uh, it was a... It was a... Present bomb. <laughs> um... Remind me to never metronome present if I'm gonna give someone a gift. Voltorb. Alright. Well, Voltorb. Oh, actually, no, no, you need to stay in Xander. I kinda would like it if you were to evolve sooner or later. Once it evolves, I might not. I'm probably gonna end up uh, filling its place. I just wanna get it evolved for the decks, really. That's all I'm doing. If you're just curious, because I am keeping it in the party for kind of a strange reason. If you I dare say so myself. Alright, anyway. Huh. Mur can- Mur is probably the only one that can do this one for now. Screech. Oof. Screech is pretty devastating if it hits. But it didn't, so I guess we're good. Headbutt. Yeah, Headbutt is pretty good for Mur. I must say. Um, let's see that guy. Oh, come on. Okay. Okay, Xander, you want to try again? Okay, that was interrupted for a long time there. Uh, I was actually asked to do something real quick. And also, on the way back, there was a spider I had to kill. <laughs> so, yeah, it was... Pretty long interruption that I'm gonna have to cut out. Uh, so what we were doing again. Oh yeah, uh, Magnemite, I got a metronome it. I don't really have much else to use here. For oh, Future Sight. I foresaw an attack. Okay, um, I guess we're gonna still use metronome. That didn't, that didn't really seem to do some damage there. No, 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 no. We need to do better. Jeez. I, oh, this Magnemite's only level 7. What am I... You know... I probably should have noticed that it was a very low level. <laughs> to be honest, I didn't... even... think. Huh. Tech. Oh, well, that's not... that's gonna... that's... <laughs> that did, like, hardly anything. Wow. Hit by Future Sight. Let's see. This might knock it out. Yep. Okay. Let's last. Magnemite again? Ugh. I definitely need a move that would hit these things super effectively. Knowing that I don't have a move that can right now means I need to make changes here. Bubble Beam. Huh. That could, that could be good. Hmm. This one's level 9 though, so it's a bit harder to knock out. Also that might hurt a bit more. Metronome? Confusion. Um... Not quite. Huh, let's see here. Anyone else want experience? Not- it's not gonna be clockwork. I don't wanna send... Beedro? Uh, yeah, Beedro can probably do this. Thundershock? Uh, I don't know. I might be able to take that one pretty well. Yeah, okay. Fury Cutter, then. Okay, I'll probably take another one of those, then. There we go. Level 16 for Xander. And the nerd was taken down. Man! Xander is still ha I don't know. Where is it? I have no idea how happy... Or whatever, I don't know. I just don't know. I think you have some rare Pokemon with you. Let me see them. 
Oh, um, I'm pretty sure I have a few of them on me. Out of the six I have. Keep in mind that you probably need... You're missing four Pokemon. I don't... So, I don't know. Pokemon... Uh, Pokemaniac Donald wants a battle. Slowpoke. Oh, another one of these Slowpokes. Ca so casually laying down on its back. Alright, uh... Sultan Mal can do this one, no problem. Thundershot. Okay. One shots. Awesome. Slowpoke is a little tanky, but uh, huh. I guess Tamal was able to break through with the very big hit there. Another Slowpoke. Where are you? The only thing that these uh, Pokemaniacs have are Slowpokes, I noticed. Yep. There we go. That was easy. Alright, and Tamal is now level 16. And I defeated Donald. That makes me mad. Alright. Oh, this is a big area over here I could go down. Whoa. Whoa. What's in here? The door's locked. Okay, I can't go that way then. Alright, well... I see that there's a staircase going up. I should probably... I wonder where this is taking me. Is this... Uh, this is probably still under the big city, Goldenrod. I was challenged to a battle downstairs. It's rough down there. You'd better be careful. I, I just came out of there, if you didn't notice. So I don't think you need to give me a, a, any of that advice. We're good. Underground entrance. Oh, I thought that was an exit, but whatever. Name Raider. Name Raider. Still waiting for someone to give me a good name for that Beedrill. But I'm guessing this is the place. I'll look in here for a moment. Hello, hello. I'm the Name Raider. I rate the names of Pokemon. Would you like me to rate your names? Uh, I'm good. I just wanted to see what's in here. Uh, this, it seems like every house looks the same. Except for the chairs. The chairs are sometimes different in so some of the houses. Jim. There's a Jim here. Goldenrod City Pokemon Gym Leader Whitney. Oh shoot. Ooh. Whitney. Alright. The incredibly pretty girl. Okay. Um. So, I actually know s there's one Pokemon. Uh, specifically in this gym that gave people trouble, and I've heard about it. Pretty much uh, every time someone mentions Whitney, they always mention her uh, mill tank about how tough it is and stuff. Whoa, this is a very green area. Why did you look away? That's rude. La 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 la. Have plenty of water, my lovely. I'm assuming that you were singing that, so let's see here. When I watered that moving tree out on Route 36, it jumped. I think it must be a Pokemon. Is it not there now? But it would take someone like Whitney, our gym leader, to beat it. Okay. Huh. Okay, that's interesting. What's this? There's a place here. Hello. Once while I was battling, my Pokemon couldn't make any moves. The power points, or PP, of its moves were all gone. Okay. Sometimes a healthy Pokemon may be unable to use its moves. If that happens, heal it at a Pokemon Center or use an item. Like, I think I am on par with what you just said. I already kind of knew that. There's a... What is this? There's a train track here that I... Am, uh, oh, you can't actually walk along the train tracks. Okay. Can't be gangster, I guess. I know there, there's a new bike shop, but I can't find it anywhere. Well, I'm gonna find it if I want a bike. <laughs> a lot of houses here, too. If you treat your Pokemon nicely, they will love you in return. Oh, let me see your Togepi. Yeah, tell me. It's friendly to towards you. It looks like... It looks sort of happy. That's it? That's all you have to say? Really? I keep losing in battles, and my Pokemon end up fainting. Maybe that's why my Pokemon don't like me much. And okay. When I use an item on my Pokemon, it actually... It acts really glad. 
Really? Huh. Huh, what other items would there be other than, uh, just, you know, generic items? I don't know. I'm not sure how that works. The world is a cycle path. <laughs> Bike shop. <laughs> cycle. The world is a cycle path. Is that is is the cycle path related to a psychopath in any way? <laughs> oh boy. Bike shop. You know what? This. Oh man. Can we get a bike? I moved here, but I can't sell my bicycles. Why is that? Could you ride a bicycle and advertise for me? Thank you. Sure. Really. Great. Give me your name and phone number. And I'll loan you a bicycle. I, I borrowed a bicycle. I didn't. I don't have it. It's not my bicycle, but I'll definitely make good use of it. My bicycles are first rate. You can ride them anywhere. Awesome. Let me. Uh. It's in the key items. I bet. Bicycle. A, a collapsible bike for fast movement. Oh man. I'm gonna actually have this thing on the select button. Figured that'd be easier for me. Oh, I have to. Ah, this isn't the time to be using that. Oh, okay. Yeah, you can't ride bikes indoors. You got it. Oh my goodness, it feels good to go fast all of a sudden. Yes, this is awesome. This is cool. I like this. Oh, I can, uh, oh, I can actually ride the bikes through here. Interesting, okay. A strange tree is blocking the road. It wriggles around if you talk to it. Oh yeah, right. I'm actually going in a circle, aren't I? But in order to do that, I need to clear that tree. I heard when it became wild when someone wired it with a squirt bottle. Hmm. What do you have? Excuse me, guy. Can you do a guy a favor? Can you take this Pokemon with mail to my friend? Here's... He's on Route 31. Route 31 isn't... Isn't that in the beginning? That's a long distance. You will? Perfect. Thanks, guy. My pal's a chubby guy who snoozes all the time. I already know who he's talking about. He's talking about that sleeping person next to that berry tree, right? You'll recognize him right away. You can't carry another Pokemon. Wait a minute. Oh my god, are you serious? I didn't... Clear space out of my party. I'll do that later. Then someone remind me that I gotta go uh, do that. But I'm not gonna do that now because I'm not gonna be able to go all the way. Well, I mean, I have a bike, so maybe I could. Goldenrod City Station. How many places have I missed? Oh, I missed all these places. The train hasn't come in. I know. I'll carry the passengers on my back. No, 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 no. That's okay. No piggyback rides. That's fine. <laughs> that won't work. <laughs> Oh boy, it doesn't... Man, why would you think to do that? Let's be real here. So this is the radio tower. Oh, that's a radio tower. This, that's a cool tower. It's a very future-looking exterior, I must say. What do you want, you pest? Scr You're rude. No, I'm going in. I don't care. Welcome. That's all you have to say? Hi, are you there for the luck... Are you here for the lucky number show? Oh, I am. Want me to check the ID numbers of your Pokemon? Do that. If you get lucky, you win a prize. I have a match, don't I? Let's see if you have a match. Nope, none of your ID numbers... What do you mean? Hold on a second. Excuse me. The number ended in zero, did it not? Are you Dude? Check that again. Two, two, three, six, zero. There's a zero on the, the last digit, and my Pokemon have a zero on the last digit as well. What are you- This is a scam. Are you- What is this? Whatever. Does it have to be an exact match? We have a special quiz campaign on right now. Answer five questions correctly to win a radio card. S slide into your Poke Gear to play the video anytime, anywhere. Would you like to take the quiz? Let's do it. Quiz time. Question one. Can the town map be displayed on a Poke Gear? Yes. Correct. Question two. 
Can Nidorina be female only? Yes. Yep. Bullseye. Question 3. Does Kurt the Pokeball Craftsman use Africorn? That is not how you spell Africorn. I'm tempted to press no for that one. So far so good. Question 4. Magikarp won't learn any TM moves. That is true. Wow, right again, and here's the final question. Professor Oak's Pokemon Talk is a very popular program. Is Mary the co-host of this show? Oh, I don't know. I have no clue. I don't know. I'm gonna press no. Bingo! You got it! Congratulations! Here's your prize, a radio card. Yep, I, by the way, I, I prepared the bell there for that one. I felt like that'd be a good time to whip it out. It can now double as a radio, wow. So it, so it upgraded, okay. Please tune in on our radio shows. Well, I would do that on a, uh, I might do that some other time, I don't know right now. I love Mary from Pokemon Talk. I only know what she sounds like, though. So the name was Mary, but she said Marie. Huh. Ben is a fabulous DJ. His sweet voice makes me melt. Oh. Okay. Alright then. Fangirls, I see. Lullabies on the video make Pokemon sleep. Huh. That's a very interesting thing to think about now that I, you can have lullabies for Pokemon on the radio. This is a really weird looking Jigglypuff. It doesn't... It looks kind of creepy. Huh. Okay. I haven't even seen an actual jiggly, jiggly puff in the game yet. You ha- uh, you can listen to the radio anywhere. Tune in. Well, if I feel like it, that is. Uh, what's your deal? You're blocking the staircase. Sorry, authorized personnel only beyond this point. It wasn't that way before. There's something wrong with the director. Director. Who's the director? Can I speak to the director? And also, what, why, why was it- why was it changed? Why was the policy changed? I don't know. Is this a sign? I can read. It is a sign. Anywhere, anytime, Pokemon Radio. That's it? Okay. That wasn't- in, that was not important in any way, but let me read this one. I didn't realize that this is a sign. Lucky Channel. Win with Pokemon ID numbers. Trade your Pokemon to collect different numbers. Huh. This is another one over here. This is a PC over here. Reception Sales. Personnel production. Director's office. This is- This place, this entire city, has the tallest buildings. Like, it's actually bigger than I even thought of. I was like walking in here- Okay, you're playing- I, <laughs> The game corner, I have a coin case now. I don't- I don't know though. I only went in just to see if I could at least, uh, play for a little bit, but, uh, it, I couldn't, so- but now I probably could. I don't know how much time I have though. Is there anything I missed, I wonder? Yeah, I'm not seeing a whole lot of stuff uh, that I probably missed uh, in terms of at least like buildings. Uh, but we, hey, we got a bike. It feels good to actually go fast all of a sudden. All right, uh, let me hop off. Does select make us hop off? Yes, it does, all right. I do want to do one thing real quick. What is this? Oh, the the audio cut out. It's no audio. How do I work this thing? Professor Oak's Pokemon Talk Show with me, Mary. Mareep may be seen around Route 42. Mareep's sweet and adorably suave and debonair. Rattata may be seen around Route 29. Rattata's pro provocatively bold oh, sort. Oh, I can't even read that one. Centret may be seen around Route 29. Centrets so flipped out and friendly. Okay, that's I'm uh, done with this one. I'm not a fan of the text going by. All or the phone ringing. Ugh phone. That was that was the actual phone, not the in-game phone. Pokemon Music Channel. It's me, DJ Ben. 
Today is Friday, so chill out to Pokemon Lullabies. No thanks. This is, is this really what happens on Fridays? Sounds like Super Mario Bros. 3 overworld music for some reason. I don't know why. Okay, we've been there before. Been there, done that. Okay. How many different channels are there? That's it? That's it? Why does it go all the way up then? I feel like there's missing channels. Also, why is there only one radio station that plays actual music and it's playing lullaby music? What? Uh... It's weird. Oh, oh. What do you need, Wade? It's nice out. Wanna battle? Oh, he wants a rematch. You're pretty far, though. Route 31, huh? I'll do that when I can. Route 31, isn't that the same place where that guy wanted me to do that other thing? I think it was. Okay. I don't know... Uh, what do we do next, anyway? It's either we go that way, we go up, which actually I think is the same thing in a way, or we can go in here, into this gym. This is the... I think we can go in right away, it's not being blocked or anything. Yo, champ, in the making! This gym is to nor this gym is home to normal type Pokemon trainers. I recommend you use fighting type Pokemon. I don't have a single fighting type Pokemon except there was that person that wanted to trade. I don't know though. I don't. Do I want to use it after I trade it? I don't know. I don't have. I don't actually have a fighting type, but I don't think normal types are all that tough. <laughs> except for one of it. On except for the one Pokemon that uh, I've heard is in that gym. But uh, that'll be in the next episode, I think. I think we go up with that one. I don't know. Yeah, I'll have to decide. I'll save the game here. Alright. And the bell says, See you in the next episode.